Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve the error you might be getting in Google Chrome, specifically the ERR underscore cache underscore miss. So many apps and web developers might receive this error when they're trying to access a certain web page. So in this brief tutorial I'll be showing you guys how to hopefully resolve this issue. So the first thing we're going to do is open up our Google Chrome web browser. Now you want to go up to the top right for the customize and control icon which will open up additional settings within Google Chrome. Again at the top right, left click on that. And then once you're on that you want to left click where it says more tools from this drop down menu and click on that and then left click on where it says clear browsing data now you don't have to keep all four of these checked by default you can just keep the cookies and other site and plugin data as well as cached images and files these two are what should be check marked so these other two are unnecessary for this video so we're going to uncheck the first two so just these two and then we're going to change the obliterate the following items from and we're going to change this to the beginning of time and then we're going to click on clear browsing data okay so once that's done um, try and get back on and see if the error is occurring again if not very good. If you're still having an issue, there's one further thing we can try here. Right click on the start button, go up to where it says command prompt and then parentheses admin and left click on that. If you receive a user account control window, select yes. So now in the elevated command line, we're going to type in ipconfig, all lowercase, space, forward slash, release. Then we're going to hit enter on our keyboard. And now we're going to type in ipconfig space forward slash all, then hit enter again. And now we're going to type in ipconfig space forward slash flush DNS, and then hit enter again. Should get a successfully flush DNS resolver cache return. Now we're going to type in ipconfig space forward slash renew and then we're going to hit enter and now at this point we're going to type in net sh space int space ip another space set space dns so basically it should read out n-e-t-s-h int ip set DNS space between all of these and then we're going to hit enter on our keyboard again and now we are going to type in net sh space winsock w-i-n-s-o-c-k and then you're going to do another space and then we're going to type a reset and then we're going to hit enter on our keyboard once again and then it'll give us the output that we should restart our computer in order to complete the reset so I'd recommend restarting your computer here so you can just close out of this elevated command prompt restart your computer and hopefully your issue has been resolved so I hope this brief tutorial helped you guys out and I will catch you in the next video goodbye